Hey y'all, welcome. Well, as you can tell from the title, today is not an unboxing. It has nothing to do with makeup, but today we're gonna think back in our elementary days when we had show and tell. And I used to love show and tell. I would think it was so much fun. I thought it was so cool what people had. And um, I thought, well, why not? That could be fun. We could do that. So that's what we're doing today. Today is my show and tell. But side note, please don't look at my hair. It's I used that M. Greengrass um, Beach Air Spray. And I thought I was going to get fancy and put that in my hair. And I think I put a little too much. <laughs> so... If it doesn't look good, just don't, don't look at it. Look at what I'm going to show you. This may be a new thing, show and tell Tuesdays. Why not? You know, just something different. Let's get started. So what I am going to show you is one of my prized possessions, okay? One of them. Now, my true of all time prized possessions are things that my kids have given me or made for me or whatever. But outside of that, this is my prized possession. Look. Yes. It's a mug. Now, no one is allowed to touch this mug. No one is allowed to drink out this mug. I don't even drink out this mug. If I sound a little congested, another side note. I don't know, my allergies are bad and I can feel it. And so excuse me if I sound a little off. Anyways, back to this mug. So yes, I don't even drink out this mug. And I know y'all are looking at me like, to hell Mary, it's a mug. It's a, you can get it at Pier 1, it's a mug. It's a green mug. Yes, but look at it. The design, but it is my favorite mug in the whole world, and I keep it in a shadow box. Yeah, I do. I do. But there's a reason for that. I received this mug back in late, I think it was late 2004, early 2005. I had to have this. And the reason for it, see, there is a reason for my craziness here, okay? I had to have it because this mug was on, well, was in a movie. Yes, it was. This mug was in 51st States. The scene that this mug was in was with um, Adam Sandler and Dan Aykroyd. There was two of these mugs, and they each have one. This went for auction. After that movie came out, they auctioned off the mugs. And I've got a certificate of authenticity. <clears throat> My mother purchased this mug for me because I wanted it so bad. Back then, I would like to look at different memorabilia from movies, TV shows. I was, I thought I was going to start getting in, getting into that and collecting stuff like that, but. I didn't. <laughs> but anyway, so back to the mug. My mom bought it for me for my birthday. We won it in the auction. So I was so excited. Here is the certificate of authenticity. 51st States. There's a picture of Adam Sandler and Drew Barrymore. Now y'all know from, well, most of y'all, if you haven't seen it, then you don't know. But my 14 question tag was, uh, who was your celebrity crush? Adam Sandler. That's why I had to have the mug. So, and it says, um, auction benefiting the nonprofit programs of Hollywood CPR. Dear collector, please know, please know that Hollywood Cinema Production Resources, Hollywood CPR, certifies that the item you have purchased on and it was eBay.com, was donated to Hollywood CPR by Sony. 
the studio that produced 51st States. This certificate warrants and guarantees that the above stated information is true and correct. So item mug, and then it's got signature, Laura Peterson, director of Hollywood CPR. And it is cinnamon, cinnamon? No, it's not cinnamon. It's cinema production resources. So, and I like that because the proceeds, you know, they went to a cause and that I really love. That is my show and tell. And one more thing, I do keep this mug in like a shadow box. This is the top. Um, I have to take it apart and I'm going to have to put the mug back in there and rebuild it back up around the mug because it's kind of flimsy. I have to be very careful with it. I think it was um, purchased at uh, Hobby Lobby. So, and then here are the little things to keep it together. It's got, it's glass. All these are, well, not glass, glass. Uh, feels like, a, yeah, it's plexiglass. And then I'm not going to build it up right now because I have a special place for it when I put it up. But, and then here's the bottom. And my mug sits right there in the middle on the bottom. I have my certificate. Yeah, I have it curled up behind it, but I am eventually going to get it straightened out somehow and put it in a frame. I just, I haven't done that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> in all these years, but that's just the way I've been keeping it. So I keep it together and yeah, that goes right behind it. And then, as I said, I just build this back up around it. And yeah, I've had family members, friends, my kids threaten to drink out of my mug. You don't know how many, or say, Hey, guess what? I drank out of your mug. And I'm like, Oh no, you didn't. That's my mug. Nobody touches it, but me. <laughs> So, I hope you enjoyed this little bit of different, well, a lot different. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. And I want you all to do this. Let's make it a tag. I love tag videos. I love them because you get to know someone on more of a personal note. Um, you know, things, what they like, what they don't like. And I just love it. So, I want to make this into a tag. I'm not going to tag any certain person. It's just whoever wants to join in and do this. Uh, go ahead and do it because I love all of you. And it's hard to for me to tag you know, certain people. So please, all of you do it. We could have a, let's start a uh, show and tell Tuesday or something. I don't know. I'll show you something next week. <laughs> but again, thank you. I hope you enjoyed this. I love y'all so much. And I don't care what it is. Do a show and tell. I don't care if it's a fork, spoon, whatever. A mug. I don't care. But come on, let's do it. Love y'all. Bye.